Sick. We were like also also really nice. Yeah. Kumbawa mina san kumbawa. Before we start this video tonight of me showing Juro Bando, one of the most amazing bands in Japanese history, I want to pay my utmost respect to Yukihiro Takahashi. He passed away this week, and I just want to show love, respect to his family, and just want to thank him for being an amazing drummer, vocalist for one of the most amazing bands, and setting foot one of the most amazing genres of music uh, that ever came out of Japan. So, my utmost respect. Uh, may he rest in peace. May he rest in power. And uh, a lot of love, peace, and positivity to his family. And I will keep spreading his amazing music uh, until forever. So please enjoy this music by the one and only YMO. Rest in peace. Hey, Okarina Sai, Mina, welcome back to the channel. And you know what it is. All of our love, peace, and positivity. We still got the one and only Jero Vandal in the yes. building. He got the glasses on right now, looking all sharp. Got them back. I lost them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Finally got them back. Yes. Looking good. And yeah, we've been recording a bunch of videos. I just showed him some videos I thought he would really enjoy. And on the next note, knowing like he had growing up as a drummer, I think we need to listen to YMO. I was gonna show you the other YMO song, but I think this is my favorite. So okay. this one's called Rydeen. And YMO is pretty much the godfather of synthesized music. Um, if you think about it, so YMO are, are three people. Sakamoto, Ruichi Sakamoto, yes, uh, Hosono, who is pretty much the godfather of uh, city pop music. He started that whole city pop sound. The whole sound, yeah. Um, I got the last guy, also super famous. Uh, we'll, we'll get to it in a second. But uh, yeah, one of my favorite bands, and it's just insane to see them perform live. Um, yeah, let's just listen to Raidin. Cool. Raidin, one of my favorite songs. By YMO. This is 1980. 1980. I had a drummer. That setup in the back. Huh? That analog. The, yeah, Since that up is crazy, this, man. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll show you later how this whole board. That's so much insane. patchwork, man. It's <laughs> like the it's, guy pulling out the thing. Yeah. It's insane. So focused. It's so fucking epic, bro. <laughs> I feel like doing like adventures. Yeah. This specific guitar sound. What? I love this specific guitar sound. Yeah. If it, it like a lot of the city pop music yeah. has the sound. Exactly. exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe later can I play you a song where the Hell exact yeah. same guitar Hell like yeah. that sound.
imagine imagine touring with all this stuff yeah like that's it, insane plus <laughs> a lot of money a lot of money yeah wow This is impressive on on so many <laughs> yeah. different aspects. First of we all, we were both quiet. We were like, "Oh, what the fuck!" It's a live show. Yeah, but it sounds like it's th like it's an original record. Yeah. yeah First yeah. of all, oh, you you know you hear the crowd yeah. like, "Ooh," you know. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Second of all, is all the gear, yeah. especially the synthesizers, because back then, yeah, you know, like now you have presets. Yeah. yeah I don't yeah. know how it was then. They def definitely had some presets. They were but programming some stuff, probably. Yeah, but an analog synth. Yeah. Imagine traveling in an RV show. You have to <laughs> set that up and then create, recreate the sounds. Yeah, uh, yeah, because that's the whole dope thing about this yeah. song. It never sounds the same. Yeah, like, it's impossible. It live, I it's, guess it's because yeah. it's analog synths. They're like because I showed this one to like Jael. Like I can show you. Let's just skip through here. They have the same board here in the back, and it's insane. But it's a year before. It's a year before. Yeah, just a little part. Otherwise, you get copyright for different. Oh songs yeah, 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 yeah. But um, so the same song. This is them performing this like with a smaller. In, it's with the, only the three of them. Yeah, uh, yeah. Like with a smaller, and then we can see how that sounds. <laughs> Mm. Definitely all old. <laughs> this must be newer. Yeah, this is newer. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. Ten years ago. Oh, okay. Yeah, or fifteen years. Sick. We were like also also really nice. Yeah. I love their outfits. <laughs> Traditional clothing, right? And it's funny because I think when they finish, because I, I don't think they plan to do this. I yeah. think this is for us for a TV show. And it's so funny, like when they finish. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> it's, it's so quiet, Eddie. <laughs> it's like all their energy yeah. went into it. They're like. <coughs> <laughs> he was trying to hold it in. <laughs> They were all trying to hold it in. They're like, <laughs> shout uh, out. So yeah, that's why I'm all cool. Like really cool. Legends, I really legends. like it, man. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, this is. I think you as a like, especially producer, drummer, that you would appreciate this kind of music way more yeah. than anything. Um, yeah, because you 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 just know how much work goes into it, and 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 how how impressive it is yeah you know? i think it, you have to be do it more for love than for money especially oh, in the yes. beginning like they yeah. probably didn't even make money in their first tours like to 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 fly around and make sure like 10 people get around with all these instruments all these boards I all this stuff and still like ask normal price tickets yeah uh, from people yeah it's it's almost not possible to get rich from it now it's different of course but back in the day yeah i i would assume inside japan yeah easier. it would be easier because you can drive yeah exactly you Just can like probably drive everywhere yeah but then imagine if they had overseas shows yeah, they were doing like they were doing yeah because they were pretty famous in america yeah Greek theater they were in europe they were everywhere but then i would assume they would uh rent yeah i think so but i mean those Gear. boards those those yeah. thin boards that i think they need to that's something you program you cust and you yeah. customize yourself yeah so, yeah. yeah crazy yeah that's really crazy yeah shout out thank you for still being here we're gonna move on to the yes. next one and we got the one and only Jarrell vandal make sure to follow the man on instagram yes, where he posts most of his adventures uh instagram.com slash vandal the one and only drinking his tea enjoying life Jero has one of the craziest DJ shows I've, I always see. He's notoriously famous for getting naked. We also <laughs> call him the naked DJ. Uh, so yeah, if you want to see a good show, go head over to Jero Vandal show. Yes, and, uh, it's gonna be crazy. Like right now, I'm really calm, you know, <laughs> chilling. But when I play, it's different. Yes. It just, I don't know. It just yeah i just get hyped you know just it's just uh <laughs> we, we all know you get hyped we lose you really quick but uh yeah we'll see you on the next one it's all about love peace and positivity